Azure Advisor, do you know? Well, if you're looking to optimize your Azure applications cost, then you are in the right place. Stick around in this video as we explore the ins and outs of Azure Advisor and how it can supercharge your cloud journey. Hello and welcome back to the Tech Blackboard. In this episode 26, we will talk about Azure Advisor, a very important Azure service. So let's start with understanding what is an Azure Advisor and then we will talk about why do you need this service and how can you use this service to better control the cost of your Azure solution. And friends, always remember, no matter how good Azure architect you are, if you're not able to control the cost, you are of no use for your company. So with that thought in mind, let's get started. So what is an Azure Advisor? Well, according to Microsoft, Advisor is a personalized cloud consultant that helps you follow the best practices to optimize your Azure deployments. It also analyzes your resource configuration and usage telemetry and then recommends the solution that can help you improve the cost effectiveness, performance, reliability and security of your Azure resources. And I'm sure that some parts of this official definition could be little cryptic, but just stay in this video and you will understand everything. Now friends, you may ask, why do you need Azure Advisor? Well, imagine this scenario. When we are building the solutions in Azure, we often use a bunch of different tools and services such as Azure SQL database, web services or virtual machines. Each of these services needs to be set up and configured and mostly you have developers, administrators or solution architects doing this job. But let's admit this that none of us is expert in every single Azure service. So it's really easy to miss out on some crucial settings that could end up affecting your application or the whole platform. And that's where Azure Advisor steps in. So you can think it as a service that always keeps an eye on all the services and the components in your solution. So friends, it's pretty much like having a helpful assistant who constantly check if things can be made better following Microsoft best practices. Because let's face it, when you're new to the Azure or maybe even at the pro level, Microsoft probably has always some great tips that could make your application work smoother or your whole Azure platform to run more efficiently. And the best part, the Azure Advisor gives you suggestion on a range of things. For example, how much your Azure resource costs, how well they are performing, how reliable they are and how secure your application is. An advisor even helps you nail down the operational excellence. Guess what? All these suggestions are sent either to the admins or the developers of your application. So you can set it up to give you a heads up whenever there are new suggestions waiting for you. So this is the official Microsoft documentation on Azure Advisor. It says that you should do more with less. It also tells you that you can reduce costs, increase the efficiency of your cloud investment. Azure Advisor offer actionable recommendations to help you optimize your Azure resources for reliability, security, operational excellence, performance and the cost. And further, as it tells you that it gives you best practices to optimize your Azure workloads, it also gives you step-by-step -step guidance and quick actions for fast remediation. And not only that, it also gives you a score to access how well architected your workloads are and also gives you alerts to notify about your new and available recommendations. And if you scroll on this documentation even further down, you will understand how to optimize your deployments with personalized Azure recommendation. Not only that, you can take actions quickly and easily using Azure Advisor on all the recommendations given by it and further it tells you whether you are following the best practices in your workloads and then my friends it gives you all the optimization recommendation all in one place. But finally my friends on this documentation I want to come down to this section which says Azure Advisor is free. But is that all true? Let's find it out. It says that Azure Advisor is available at no additional cost. However, my friends, you should note that some recommendations can incur costs upon remediation. For example, enabling virtual machine backup can incur charges for the backup. So friends, Azure Advisor aims to help you find cost efficiencies while you follow the best practices. So friends, in a nutshell, while the Azure Advisor itself is free, but then you always must take care that when you're implementing all the recommendations, then some of the recommendation can cost you some money. All right, now let's go to the Azure portal and have a closer look at the Advisor dashboard. So friends, on the Azure portal, there are many ways to access the Azure Advisor. First of all, on this left hand side blade, you can access the Azure Advisor using this option. Also, you can go to the global search and type advisor and then you can find the Azure Advisor here as well. Let's talk about this dashboard in a little bit more detail. So first of all, let me zoom it a little bit more. I think now it's better visible. So here you can see that we have five categories given here. The first one is cost. 
then we have security reliability operational excellence and performance so let's dive in into each of these categories let me start with the cost so this is your go-to category for optimizing your spending in azure and what can i say we all want to save some bucks right well azure advisor helps you identify ways to reduce your overall spending and this is like having a money saving expert right at your fingertips and then come security recommendations so friends security as i have stressed many times before security is a top priority and that's where security category comes into the play and you can think it off as your virtual security guard advisor keeps a vigilant eye on all the threats that could lead to security breaches azure advisor keeps a vigilant eye on all the threats that could lead to security breaches in your solution and then we come to the reliability recommendations remember your application needs to be up and running always so this reliability category will ensure the continuity of your business critical applications and this is like having a guardian for your application uptime now friends who does not want the applications to be running smoothly operational excellence is all about boosting your processes workflows and resource management an advisor gives you tips and best practices to help you excel like a pro and no one can disagree that speed matters in the digital world and that's where the performance recommendations really shine whether it's improving your application's responsiveness or enhancing the overall speed azure advisor has got your back so these are the five categories on which azure advisor gives you the recommendation let's have a closer look on the cost recommendation so here you can see my friends azure advisor is giving me tons of recommendations to save my cost here it says that if i choose the right size or shut down the underutilized virtual machine i can save up to 468 us dollars and similarly my friends if i consider purchasing a saving plan for my compute then i can save up to 385 euros and in the same manner my friends you can go through all the recommendations be it cost recommendation security reliability all these recommendations will help you increase the overall efficiency of your application and reduce the cost so that's why my friends before i summarize i want to quickly say that imagine that you are a captain steering a ship and of course you want the smoothest and the safest and the most efficient journey right so if you are the captain of the ship consider azure advisor like your trusty navigator it's a really smart helper from microsoft that guides you to make your cloud ship sail better so let's summarize quickly firstly accessing the advisor dashboard in this step you have to head over to the azure portal as i just showed you in the menu you will spot the azure advisor click on it and voila you are inside the azure advisor and then comes exploring the recommendations as a second step inside the dashboard you will see the categories that we talked about earlier like cost recommendations security recommendations and so on and you can choose which one to focus based on what you are aiming for and lastly as a third step comes diving into the details so each recommendation comes with the detail inside it's like getting the full breakdown of what's happening and why it is suggested and as we all say knowledge is power so get the detailed view of each recommendation pick up the recommendation that you want to prioritize the most and go for it so in the conclusion I can just say that Azure Advisor is a magical tool from saving the cost and boosting security to ensuring reliability and optimizing your operation it's like having your cloud journey on autopilot so next time you're in the Azure portal do not forget to swing by the Azure Advisor dashboard and let those recommendations work their magic and of course my friends not only Azure Advisor but you can also do some magic by liking this video and help us reach more and more audience just like you and in case you have some questions or topics that you want me to cover drop them in the comment section or email me at connect us at the rate the tech blackboard.com and do not forget to watch our real exam question and answer series on aws cloud practitioner exam and that's all for today i will see you in the next video till then stay fit keep learning and thanks for watching